All right, all right. Hey, what's going on, man? My name is Leonidas Gist. Thanks for tuning into this video. I'm here talking to you today. This video is really going to be about Facebook ads. Um, making this video because I'm seeing like alongside myself, like a few years ago, I used to have a lot of issues with Facebook ads, right? And um, I thought for a long time I couldn't be the only person having these problems, so I started to do some sh to shoot some videos sharing some of these insights. And about a year, a year went by, man, and before a lot of people started really having problems with their Facebook ads. So I wanted to share a hack, um, how I was able to be able to, I've been able to advertise on Facebook now for mm, over a decade. And it hasn't been, it has not been an easy battle. You know what I mean? It's been pretty tough, I'll be honest with you, because I've had to go through multiple, multiple ad accounts over the years. Um, probably three, four hundred ad accounts I've gone through over the last uh, five, six years now, and I wanted to start to show some of the hacks that uh, you know I kind of figured out uh, along the way because uh, a lot of people, a lot of people don't know about this stuff. And when I, when some of the stuff that I learned, you know, even top marketers that are out there, they don't even know some of these secrets. You know what I mean? And when I say top marketers, I mean guys that are doing millions of dollars. Um, and I buy, buy the trainings and go through it and I don't sometimes I don't really learn anything new about this stuff because they don't really know about it you know what I mean so they just have the money to just buy any Facebook account from somebody and keep the ball going but what happens if you don't have the money um and, and I'll share a quick story with you for my journey um I've had my business has been um I will, for a while for a few years I was struggling it going up and down up and down up and down trying to trying to figure out like a process a method that worked um, and one of the biggest struggles I had was getting leads, you know what I mean? And, and um, today, I think Facebook, Instagram, are probably, and meeting people in person, right? But it takes too long to build a good lead list that way. You got to do it on autopilot. And YouTube as well. YouTube's a great resource for leads. Um, but it, sometimes it can take too long. With Facebook, you got the best of both worlds. You know what I mean? You got a big audience pool. Let me I'll just do a quick little look up. Let's see. Uh, let's do user social media. Let me just show you guys uh, when I'm talking social media. Uh, let's just to search for it this way. How many users are on Facebook and Instagram? Let's see what this pulls up. Images. I hate this. 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 Uh, I hate this thing. This search thing is so annoying. Let's see what it pulls up. Um, no, nah, I needed. I wanted a graph. But anyway, um, damn, Google is gonna Google like cancel Google. I hate this damn search thing, man. There you go, Google. Shit, I don't want to go. Dang, I want to Google. Yeah, we go. Yeah, this search thing annoys the crap out of me, man. If y'all know how to fix this, drop a link below. I need some. Here we go. It still does it, man. I hate this crap. <laughs> this thing is so annoying. All right, here we go. 718. All right, I'm not. Let's see. It's different states. All right, number of users. All right, so this is still 2008. 2008. 2018, sorry. Damn, I'm <laughs> 2008. Um, I would love to have gotten more. Uh, more up to date data on this, though. You know what I mean? Like 2020. Oh, this is content. I want to learn about. That counts though, you know what I'm saying? See how difficult they're making search today, <coughs> right? And I just want to get in the search. Go to Google. See, it's taking me all around the world. What the devil? It's taking me everywhere, man. Like I just want to go to Google. See how they're making this thing so difficult? In 2020, let's see. Boom. Still taking me back to this whack thing, man. Z 
this is giving me 2018. All right, let's just do this one just to not waste any more time on this. All right, so 2019, we're talking 500 million. 500 million users right now on a platform, you know what I'm saying, on Instagram. 500 million people, which is huge. That's up 100 million from 14, from 18, sorry. So that, that just lets you know, you know, there's so much, so much traffic that you could get off Instagram or Facebook. Uh, we'll dive into Instagram ads in another video. That's a pretty powerful platform. But right now, we're just talking Facebook. But you can run Instagram ads for Facebook, which makes it very, very, very powerful. Um, so, yeah, a lot of when you first get started on Facebook, right, you come out the gate. Uh, let me just show you really quick. When you come out the gate, a lot of people don't know about this. I stumbled upon this back in 2009, how to advertise on Facebook. Um, and you see how, see how down here where it says advertise? Just click on that, and it's going to take you over to the regular advertising uh, platform. This is, you know, some good information that they bring for you on it, but now it's taking the Facebook business. Before, I never used to do that. So, hang on, hang on a second. Let's go back. Because if you go into the, oh, let's go back to that one because it actually has it right there. All right, so it says d -d 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 create an ad. All right, so let's go to create an ad. It's going to take you right to your ad ads manager. Right, ad center, ad create. It's probably going to take you to the guided creation, which I've never, ever used. It's To me, it's really annoying to use that joint. Um, I like to use the in-depth uh, approach, and I'll show it to you if it pops up here in a second. Come on. Anyway, ah, that's taking too long. Let's get over to the ad. Let me show you this real quick. So let's go into ebooks. Open an ads manager. But when you get started, you really only have one ad account, right? But there's a way where you can have like 20, 30 ad accounts on one Facebook account. And uh, it's a cool little hack that we're going to get into here in a second. All right. So when you get started, you literally just have this one ad account, right? Hold up. You have this one ad account that is some more ad account. You just have like your personal ad account, right? Mine's deactivated right now. I got to get into Facebook. Only have active accounts. The um, only active accounts can create ads. So I got to go back in and fix this and all that stuff and do all that jazz. And I'll, I'll show it to you in another video, another updated video in, uh, later on. But um, you get one ad account, right? So in order for you to have multiple ad accounts, I mean, you might already know about this. You just got to go to uh, business.facebook.com. Uh, hang on, let me... um do it on a fresh incognito page business.facebook.com right forward slash overview and remember this because you're going to use this a few times in order to do this see how it brings you to the business manager now it's not going to let you go any further unless you log in on the facebook account okay it's not going to let you go any further so um what i'll do is i'm going to log into let me see um one of my very first Facebook accounts just to show you. Um, I don't even know my password. Let's see if that works. That wasn't it. Ah, that's not it. Ah, what is it? I don't even know. Let's go to this one and see if it works. Just to show you what I'm talking about. For example purposes. I got so many different Facebook accounts I've used for this purpose. Um let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Boom, all right, we in. All right, so see now it, it, it allows me to create a new account. So I'm just going to go ahead and create a new tab. That's not going to let me. I'm going to create an account. Um, and then we'll go with at gmail.com. Just make believe email for whatever. All right, so I got to use a capital letter. Boom. So street address, put that on there, it's fine. United States. Website, Facebook. Dot com. Facebook.com, boom. 
So see how it says my payment account is disabled. All right, so let's go in there. And this is like my very, 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 very first ad account on Facebook, right? So let's go to advertising. And this will happen from time to time. They might just shut your entire ad account down. So don't sweat over it. Don't lose no sleep or nothing, all right? Do not lose any sleep over this. If they shut you down, don't worry about it. There's always a workaround, all right? If it's... And and please do me a favor. Do not get see how this old. I hate this creation mode, man. This is so annoying. Um, don't don't get married to your Facebook account. Okay, it's not even your account because you don't own Facebook. Okay, so yeah, you have personal stuff on there, rah 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 rah. But Facebook wants just like they did to me. Okay, they shut down one of my most valuable Facebook accounts I ever used. I made so much money on that account. It was ridiculous, man. And and um. It was just annoying having to go through and lose all that, okay? So, um, but it's not the end of the world, so don't, don't, don't stress over it. Just make sure that, you know, you have, if you, if you want to stay in touch with friends and family on that account, do that. But you're going to use other Facebook accounts that you're going to create, okay? See how it says my ad accounts are disabled. You, I can't make any more ads. If this ever happens to you, don't get frustrated by it, all right? Do not get frustrated by this this might be able to get fixed i don't know i'm gonna dig in and, and find out if it can get fixed then i'll let you know i'll keep you updated but um yeah don't get her butt hurt by this all you got to do is just start a new account and to do that you want to get you could get you like a um a burner cell or an email i say get a burner cell because the cell phone number is a lot more um facebook has more confidence with them you know what i mean because it's, it's personal to you so that helps keep your ad account clean and helps keep your, your business safe. You know what I'm saying? So once you get over to like this portion here and you can uh, you have a good ad account where you can actually create um, ads, it's very, very simple. OK, once you get started with this and you have like a new business manager account, well, Facebook's going to do. They're only going to allow you to create one ad, uh, one ad account at a time. So there's a couple of other little tricks that we'll talk about in other videos we'll dive we'll dive deep into this and kind of show you how to set this up because it's a little tricky so i'm going to go over to this other ad account that i have ad accounts and you're going to see there's only one ad account here right now and this is for um this is this is for a, a new account that i'm building for someone right so if i wanted to create another ad account literally could just come in here sometimes they limit you to one right see now this it won't let me do it on this one and that could be a couple of reasons it could be one because i'm not admin but i am i'm admin on here so it's not allow, allow me to do that on this ac particular account because for one facebook needs to see good they need to see good uh what you call it they need to see good behavior patterns and payment methods before they allow you to create additional ad accounts you know what i mean so they want to see that you're good at paying your bills first kind of like it's kind of like a credit check almost but then when you get good at it right let's go over here to this one you get good at it and you start paying your bills on time you, you, if you're running ads for clients the clients are paying the bills on time it's not there's no delay in payments then it makes it easy for you to be able to come in here now see your ad accounts and then just go boom i need to create an ad account Boom, and then something to keep in mind if your ad account, if you have, um, and this is for my Instagram, uh, one of my Instagram accounts I'm building up. Um, if my, if you have a, uh, what's I gonna say? If you have a, a disabled account, right? Disabled meaning like, all right, I'll show you in a second. I see, I, I was able to create that. Let me try to create another one. Let's see if, if, it, if it allows me to do it, right? K2, K4, K43, whatever. It don't matter. I can change that later. Um, it'll go my business. It might give me error and say, nope, you create, you reach ad account maximum. You can increase your limits by making a payment on your business account. See so your ad account limit, blah, blah, blah. So like on this particular ad account, they may allow me to pay, make to create up to 11 ad accounts on here. Up to 11, you know what I mean? But you got to, um, actually it's up to 22 you could do per account really. So I found another hack where you can actually uh, create like I'll show you on this one right here where I did it. I created one. These are all my own accounts where I created one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, four, four business manager accounts on this one Facebook account. It's a cool new hack I just found. 
Uh, I don't even think Facebook understands this stuff yet because there's it just doesn't make sense to me. But it's a cool little hack. So um, we'll talk more about how you can get multiple um, uh, business managers back here and have like 11 to 22 ad accounts per. So if you have one, if you like me right now, you got one, two, three, four. You could have, what, 44, right, ad accounts or like what's the math on that? I don't even know. For, uh, what's that? 22 by 4. I don't even know. I'm it's simple. I know it's simple. 22 times 4, right? That's 88. Duh. 88 ad accounts you can have duh, um, on one Facebook account. It might seem like, well, why would I need 88 ad accounts? Well, when Facebook started to get messy and they start to shut your ad accounts down, then you're going to know why you need multiple ad accounts, okay? Because the one thing you don't want is keeping your uh, your business standstill. It's like if you had... If you had you got if you got a car and that car goes bad, you are stranded. But if you have like two, three cars and one car goes down, oh you could just grab another one. You know what I mean? So it's pretty easy to keep your business going once you got your Facebook ads like that running. So um I hope this helps you, man. I hope this really helps you to uh open up your mind a little bit about the at the business manager. We're gonna we're gonna dive deep in some more. I don't wanna keep you here too long on this because I want to make sure that you're understanding what you're doing and you're just getting it in chunks so that way you can, um, you know, get your ads out there and understand how this works so you'll be able to take this to the ne next level. So let me know. Shoot me a message in the DM on Instagram, uh, at Kaylee, Unitas 300. Let me know if you had if you got any specific questions that I can include in the next video. Um, I'd love to be able to share some more content with you. Uh, I'm going to sh share with you how you can actually start making money today, launching your own e-commerce brand in an upcoming video. Uh, just so you can see, uh, let me just show you a little bit on this. What else? Me and e-commerce on, for instance, one of my partners that I'm working with right now, we spent thirty k, thirty two thousand, thirty one thousand dollars on this one ad account. So you can imagine what the sales look like. Or look, or the sales are looking like on that account, um, on that store. So um, definitely get with me, and let's uh, help you to start making profits today. So I'll see you at the top of the bank, and most definitely on the beaches of the world, man. My name is Leonidas Gist. Hope that this helped. Subscribe to my channel, shoot me some love on Instagram, share this video with your friends, educate them about making money online, come back and listen to take this thing from where you are to the next level. Peace.